Hey guys, it's uh, Altoman107 here. I just wanted to uh, give a quick review of the PlayStation Move and its devices. Um, I got this a week ago, maybe, and I gotta tell you, I'm very satisfied. It's uh, got a $99.99 price tag, but it's well worth it. Um, here's the controller that comes with it. It's a nice curved design, fits very well in your hand. Trigger feels natural and great. It's got the LED ball on top so you can track your 3D motions. Like when you get closer, it recognizes that you get closer. And when you twist it, it actually twists with you. Unlike the Wii on that part. And I got two of these because you're going to probably need them for like the game the fight lights out is gonna require two of these because you've got two fists and you're gonna be fighting with both of them so that's what I got and then I got one of these the uh, navigation controller or the nunchuck from uh, the Wii and it's a great design I just I like doing this just going through the XMB menus you know just little convenient little thing um this will be great for first person shooters like um mag has a uh, extension on this if you get the greatest hits edition um see there's an analog stick the d-pad and there's the circle and the x buttons on here and then there's a trigger and the l1 button on the actual move controller you have the standard X circle square triangle the home button the move button and the trigger and this is also something that came with it was the PlayStation I and I'm very impressed with this this is this has a very wide range of motion and sometimes it's a little dodgy I'll give it that when you have some when you have the orb behind something and it can't read it that's kind of a fail but and it also oh, came with sports champions which is PlayStation move required it's got Archery, ping pong, uh, bocce ball, um, and a lots of. It's got all right. Archery, bocce ball, table tennis, uh, frisbee golf, and volleyball. I wish they had more. That's the, my only complaint with this game, is I wish they had more sports like uh, we had with their Wii Sports. Um, and yeah, um, this together, the PlayStation I, the Move Controller, and the Sports Champions is $99. $99. Um, this is in and of itself was $50. I got this at GameStop because it was sold out on Amazon. And this itself is $30. Um, if you're getting a if you're getting the move for a uh, first-person shooter game, this is great to have because, uh, like Resident Evil 5, for instance, um, you need these triggers and these buttons up here to move your move your guy around. And uh, if you're planning on getting SOCOM 4, this is also required. So, again, my impressions: very, very good sensitivity pickup um, compared to the Wii, where you just flick. To get something done, you actually have to do the entire motion. Like with a frisbee in Wii, you probably just went and it threw it as hard as it could. In this one, you've got to come back and throw it like a normal frisbee. Um, and what I've seen of the fight, you have to actually extend, not just flick forwards and it'll hit them. And then um, the uh, gladiator, gladiators in uh, sports champions as well. Um, you have to actually swing the motion, like the full motion to get to hit someone. And, um, I thought the reactivity of these were great. 
Uh, again, I'll give it a 9 out of 10 just because on the sports champions there isn't enough games. And if this is behind something, this little orb here, and uh, it can't pick it up when it's behind something. So my room is, is little, uh, and it's a little cramped, so I can't really... I uh, have two people in there without this being blocked by something. Um, so yeah, um, overall, very good system if you're uh, into motion gaming. And yeah, uh, comments, questions, just uh, feel free to let me know, and I will answer promptly, hopefully. Have a good one.